2023 remember guys to like share comment and follow so former deputy prime minister atam tambara at the launch of his book ideas and solutions say that the divorce case of robert mugabe's daughter bona reviewed how the ruling elite had looted zimbabwe leading to its economic collapse Mutambara highlighted that Bona owned numerous properties including 21 farms and questioned how many farms Robert Mugabe, his two sons, the vice president and other ministers owned. He said, if Bona Mugabe has 21 farms, how about her father? You should ask yourself how many farms does the late president Robert Mugabe and his other two sons have? How many do you think the vice president and other ministers have? Court records show that Bona and the estranged husband Sembach Kore owned arms, an 8 million mansion in Dubai and a fleet of luxury cars. The one man one farm policy in Zimbabwe is a land reform program that seeks to ensure that each farmer owns only one farm to address the issue of land ownership in quality. The policy was implemented in response to the concentration of land ownership in the hands of a few individuals, mostly white commercial farmers during colonial and post-independence periods. Under this policy, the government has been redistributing land from those with multiple farms to landless peasants and small-scale farmers with the aim of promoting equitable distribution of land resources. There have been reports of violations of the one man one farm policy, particularly during the tenure of former President Robert Mugabe. Some individuals, including members of Mugabe's inner circle, were found to have acquired multiple farms while others were evicted from their land without due process. These actions were criticized for undermining the goal of the land reform program to promote equitable distribution of land resources and redress past injustice. The current government has also been accused of selectively enforcing the policy and allowing some individuals to hold multiple farms. Reports indicate that some farms acquired during Zimbabwe's land reform program remain underutilized due to lack of resources and skills among beneficiaries. This has resulted in reduced agriculture productivity and food shortages despite Zimbabwe's potential as a major agricultural producer. And so, when it comes to Nyaya Bonamugabi, yes, some people do agree, some people don't agree. Some people want to join, I mean, Wamugabi Wakatonga Zimbabwe for almost like 38 years or so. Saga, I mean, through the years, the man was earning money. Saga, Ufumi Wanu Wamugabi, Uruwasira Wana Wamugabi, Aushamisi, Nokuti Wamugabi, Munu, but I turned Rome Maripa Muizi. At the same time, I mean, he was the president so he deserves everything that he has other people they always think you know what Iowa a city why can someone else have 21 farms whereby uh, and it's debatable on social media so many people came up with so many many theories so many suggestions so many views opinion some think that there's nothing wrong about Bonamukabe's assets and everything some people say with Iowa I said, I wanna say, and I got it the comment section, guys. This is weekly news roundup on Prince Miller Entertainment TV. Remember, guys, to like, share, comment, and follow. Yes, Bonam Gabi, and my properties, and Mari, and Jaka Siro, and I'm Gabi, of course. Jaka Mina Kuna Bonam Gabi, Jenga Jina, I'm Gabi, and I saw people still question could go Chatunga, Robert Mugabe Jr. Why my properties are pure gas or no Mugabe? Why is our gas or footage rather than get rid of our will? And the Saga, there are some of the questions that we might try to ask or try to get some answers, but at the end of the day, Jesus of Opera Janko Daru, Ufumi Wanao, Bachango Rambawana, Ufumi Wo, I shall both as a catchinger, and the Rumende Iripo, I don't think we can buy anything from the Mugabe family because 2017. They had an agreement that they won't touch anything as uh, now from Gabi. But anyway, the story for another day. But I do agree with what um Am Tambara is saying here. But at the end of the day, Wanazo, Wanazo, Kanawasina, Wuna. There's no way Bonam Gabi 
uh, we will surrender those 21 farms uh, to the Zimbabwean government. I don't even think uh, all those farms are being utilized. Some of them maybe no one knows, but for one person to have those kind of farms is questionable. It's really questionable to go on farms for one person. I did turn the comment section, guys. This is weekly news roundup on Prince Milan Entertainment TV. Thank you for listening. Thank you for watching. Bless up.